Hey Lewis, after losing a couple of spots at the beginning, you got those back, but was it frustrating not really being able to do much more than that? Yeah, I was giving it everything, but uh, yeah, a bit stuck behind um, a few people at the beginning, a bit unlucky. Um, but you know, you live and let you learn, and I, I got back to sixth, we got, we, got, um, we got points, so didn't lose anything today really. Heard you asking the team on Team Radio about the strategy, would you fancy trying to pit maybe on the safety car and just try something else? Um, I, I really don't know. It doesn't really matter. So, uh, as I said, we got the points and we move on. Hey, George, uh, you asked the team to leave you out to give you a chance of a safety car. Would come and it came, so you must be pretty pleased with how that worked out. Yeah, I mean, you sound like a bit of a genius when things like that happen, but it was total fluke. And um, yeah, I mean, it was obviously a good day to, to come home in P5. Especially after lap one, I was down in P16. I thought, okay, it's going to be a long afternoon. And um, but we showed some good pace, still far from where we were on Friday. So we need to understand why that is. And uh, yeah, P5 again. If obviously the safety car hadn't happened, would it have been a frustrating way to end this weekend? That's been quite difficult all the way through, hasn't it? I mean, I'd have ended up P7, which I think, given where we were yesterday, that was a relatively good result, especially after lap one. But. You know, there's a fast racing car there somewhere, but we don't know how to how to, to get that. You know, we had to get that performance. We showed it Friday, and then it just suddenly all disappeared yesterday.